man. So it's nine o'clock. I'm on my way home. You can see I'm all red and the hair is all disheveled and <laughs> these sex dates, man. It's like I was too uh I'm intimidated or shy or embarrassed also because I, uh, you know, what do you call when you do it too early? And then they, it wouldn't get up after that. And, um, and it was just, it was just, I mean, I was really attracted, but. It's just so, um, you know, I didn't cover my head or anything. It just led to things and, but then it was like a lot of times I was just there, you know, and feeling like ashamed or embarrassed as it wasn't, wasn't up because communication was bad. And not used to that type of person. You know, it was just weird. And then he said, "Hey, if you're ever in my area, right, you know, Playa del Carmen, you know." I'm like, "Oh, I haven't thought about that." Uh, you know. So, um, you know, me and my many problems. So, I, I don't know. Then he kept saying, like, I'm his type, like, really his type. And he took a picture of us, and I'm, like, all red and pale and hair disheveled. And it was just, it was, it was awkward. It really was. Um... I know a lot of it had to do with me because I don't know how <laughs> whoa, see I don't know how I act in these uh, situations I've gotten so used to I don't know substandard people, I don't know people who I dominate or whatever or I, I don't know it was just awkward but he already has um, a boyfriend of 10 years but they they live in separate places and obviously they fool around I don't know I really don't know what to make of it but I was like I didn't really want to leave but I really did because I mean like what's the point you know I just got out, so I, know, I have no idea what to make of it, you know? And I think it's because he didn't come, so he was all on me, you know? And I did. So then, the whole time I couldn't get it up after that, you know? And I didn't come a lot. It was just... Like a premature. You know, because I guess my mind is just psychologically for me, it's just really, really, it's really bad. I don't know. I really don't know what to make of this. He doesn't live here. I've, I don't even know if I should contact him. What's the point? You know? Oh, that's nice. The orange in the back. So, I don't even have, I'm not even going to oil my hair again. I'm going to wash it. He was playing with it. And it's like, anyways. I'm 
I'm just, you know, talking, blabbing right now. It's like this happened. I don't, I don't know what to make of it. Nice view. Eh? But anyways. I, I, I can't make a decision right now. It was. But he was going out to uh, come with me. He was going to go get to a bakery to get something to eat. But everything's closed now. I had four protein bars, so I gave him one. I gave him two, actually. I was like, hey. Yeah. I don't know. I was just... I couldn't be myself. And, uh, uh, you know, it's the spontaneous sex type thing. There was another guy who was supposed to come, and he didn't come. And so this guy was here, and he was already open. So that was cool. And I liked him better in person. Tomorrow morning I have to get up, get myself ready for the dentist, not do too much work because um, I'm going to get up at 6 maybe and leave by 8.30 to get to the dentist and then go to the gym. probably gonna upload this it's not live but so yeah. all right stopping in here